I always recommend that if you're concerned about a diagnosis of visual snow being possible, that you need to try and select an appropriate doctor who is aware of visual snow as, as a problem and is prepared to consider it as a diagnosis. Uh, I think it's always worthwhile consulting the Visual Snow Initiative websites to see if there's somebody uh, closely accessible to you. Otherwise, I think uh, if you go to, in the United States for instance, if you go to any of the uh, large uh, neurological institutes, uh, particularly those that have uh, neuro-ophthalmology, you're very likely to find somebody who is prepared to consider the diagnosis. But the answer really is that you never really know until you, you see somebody whether or not they're appropriate. But at the risk of telling people to doctor shop, if you're convinced you have symptoms and you don't think you're getting an appropriate answer, you do need to uh, consider seeing somebody else.